In this busy street, people and dogs live together. But in this community, the bond between human and dog is being tested. In many countries around the world, people and dogs are at risk from rabies. Rabies is a potentially fatal disease, most commonly spread through dog bites and scratches. Where it exists, people are scared. Daybreak, in a scene repeated around the world, a dog killing team is out on the streets to catch and poison as many dogs as possible. You may find what you're about to see disturbing. These dogs are captured by surprise, squeezed in the grip of giant metal pincers, then dragged along the gravel road to a truck. They are injected with an unmeasured dose of poison, their still breathing bodies then thrown into the back of the truck. Some dogs survive the first dose of poison and need to be injected again. 20 million dogs are killed by brutal means every year, and rabies is often used as the excuse. But this suffering is entirely needless. Killing dogs in response to rabies has never been shown to eliminate this disease. The World Society for the Protection of Animals is calling for governments to adopt the scientifically proven, humane and sustainable alternative, mass dog vaccination. Here, on the island of Bali, WSBA supported the government in a campaign to vaccinate its dog population against rabies. Collars were given to every vaccinated dog. They have become a symbol for the community. These collars show that dogs are protected against this deadly disease. Death from rabies, both animal and human, is entirely preventable. With your help, WSPA can end the cycle of cruelty and create a world where dogs and humans live side by side once again. A world without rabies doesn't mean a world without dogs.